Hi, this is a brief review on the uh, Dart Marlin fly screen and petrol blue for a Triumph Speed Twin. Um, the screen comes really well packaged from uh, Dart, very simple to fit. Two brackets, one on either side. You take out the standard bolt for the headlamp, put the supply bolt in, fit the bracket off the side loosely, same on the other side. Then you attach the screen, two rubber grommets each side to go through the screen, two bolts each side. They're threaded bolts, so they're quite easy to fit and locate easily. Probably takes less than 20 minutes to fit the fly screen. Um, I like the fly screen in petrol blue on uh, my bike. I think it complements the bike really well, but they do do clear and smoked. Um, the fly screen in its original format uh, helps enormously with the wind blast off the Triumph. Um, it does, however, send the air pretty much into just where your neck is. I'm five foot nine, so it comes sort of up into my neck area. So what I've done is I've added the uh, Huig um, wind deflector on top. Again, this was not cheap about 40 pound from Puig, you can get it off Amazon and wherever, makes a big difference, it's fully adjustable, it's a little plastic insert that comes and goes into this under the screen, and then it just uses two Allen bolts to bolt on, and I've messed about with this on the dual carriageway for a bit now, and this is the height that suits me, and it sends the wind blast pretty much sort of into your visor or slightly over the top of your head. You can't get it fully over the top of your head at sort of 70 miles an hour, but it makes a massive difference on the Triumph. A lot more comfortable to ride at sort of highway speeds. Um, so I definitely recommend the two together. One thing I did find out though, that when I put the, uh, the Puigs on, it made a sort of screen shake a little bit. So I've made some um, basically rubber uh, spacers here to fit in front of the standard mountains for the dart. I've just made that out of just cutting up a piece of old hip armour and just gluing them together in pads for now. Now this is the first uh, go at this. Um, they'll probably look a lot nicer when I've finished them. They're just basically using the pressure between the clocks and the screen to wedge it into place but it does make it a lot, a uh, lot less vibration so it improves it a little bit. Um, again, I'll make them a little tidier and smaller, uh, I'll probably on my second or third attempt, but uh, it doesn't need them unless you put the Puig on, but I think with the Puig on it just makes it shake that little bit. Um, so overall, a really nice product, very well put together, easy to fit, uh, I think very cost effective, £99, and I'd definitely recommend it, and overall I think it adds a bit to the... Uh, the aesthetics of the Triumph and makes it a lot nicer to ride, particularly as a rider who drives all year round. So in the winter, a bit less wind blast helps. Hope you enjoy the video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Thank you.